and welcome to Life Less Ordinary. As you might be able to hear, the chainsaw is going. That means that uh, we have finally gotten it fixed, um, with thanks to a good friend. Uh, so Dean is over there uh, chopping up those trees, finally, the limbs that have fallen off uh, the tree back in, ooh, October. <laughs> now in March um, but what uh, my plan is to do right now and I said uh, in a video a couple of weeks ago that uh, our potatoes um, are dying off so now is the time to harvest them I had initially thought that I would keep them in the ground however we So Trinity has a potato. Um, so we, we had initially thought that we would um, uh, keep them in the ground and only just harvest as we needed them. Um, I did get some up uh, two weeks ago and some of them had quite obviously been in here in the ground for quite a while. They were unusable. Uh, so I have rethought what, uh, what my plan was and our intention today is to dig them all up so I've started on this pile this line here which was the last line of potatoes that I planted uh, so they were uh, uh, ones that were given to me by a friend who'd ordered uh, quite a bit um, and these were a pink uh, pink um, inside as well as outside uh, a lot of potatoes so I think they're crimson pear and a different variety um, so I think I planted probably uh, about eight potatoes in this line and I'm not sure that I've actually gotten eight potatoes back out of all that effort um, so there's a good size one here yes um, yeah and that one's not too bad but overall uh, for me that's a dif disappointing harvest uh, but what I also have is another four rows of different varieties here that we do need to harvest so what I've got is a fork uh, and we will try and lift them uh, as carefully as possible without splitting the potatoes uh, and get out as much as we can uh, so uh, I will show you what we end up with and hopefully it's not a very pitiful amount hopefully it's something that's actually quite usable uh, so we've only done this bit so far and there hasn't been that much however I'm exhausted because I've been weeding out the front uh, so I might just do a little bit more so that you can actually see what we're doing here um, uh, so it is kind of disappointing I have to say um, they've been quite small although because it's in wood chip they are actually quite clean um, but uh, there isn't a lot in here um, which is very disappointing um, so the intention was for next year uh, for next season um, to start somewhere else so probably over that direction put some wood chip down and um uh sorry some we'll put some cardboard down and a deep layer of wood chip towards the end of autumn uh so that it has uh time to compact down definitely kill the weeds and and all that sort of stuff uh and we'll plant other things in this area um i will need to buy seed potatoes um uh, I'm I, looking at that I'm not going to rely on what I've got growing uh, what I've had growing in there because they're not a great quality um, so I will start again um, uh, let me just do this a little bit here so we, so we're getting some smallish potatoes to be honest and if you've watched any of my videos you'll know that I always forget to label what I'm planting uh, so um, I can't remember exactly what the varieties were here 
um, whether they were King Edward or oh, I don't know what variety. I do remember that those pink, pinky purple ones were crimson pear. Um, but yeah, we're not. Some of these look like they're quite old. They've been in there for a while and are sort of starting to rot. So we'll have to sort through um, that box of them that's there uh, before we actually use any of them. Um, but um, yeah, it's very sparse very disappointing and that's what happens sometimes uh, you know potatoes are something that I would like to be I guess self-sufficient in um, you know there's one or two things that we definitely eat most meals and potatoes are one of them uh, so uh, I'll definitely be doing some more re research uh, preparing much better next year uh, because we do want to get a better harvest so yes this is disappointing so far um, if I do better when we harvest the rest I'll try and video it and um, hopefully we get a better result from the others but I am not expecting so um, so those are the breaks sometimes anyway thanks for joining us uh, as we live our life less ordinary